गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू आवर इंग्लिश सेशन द न्यू चैप्टर यूनिट फाइव द बलून मैन स्टूडेंट्स यू मस्ट हैव विजिटेड टू द मार्केट प्लेस राइट एंड इन दैट यू मस्ट हैव सीन द बलून मैन द हु केयर इज सेवरल ऑफ बलून विद डिफरेंट कलर्स सो कभी कभी आप जिद भी करते होंगे मम्मा आई नीड दैट बलून पापा आई नीड दैट बलून आप सब ये जिद भी करते होंगे so here today we are going to learn about a small poem that is a balloon man so in this the writer of this the balloon man is rose rose fine she was a writer she was famous for writing a children's story right ki wo bachcho ke liye he rhymes bachcho ke liye story about the children she was writing and she was famous for famous for it in her generation jab unki generation thi to wo bahut famous the wo bachcho ke liye stories novels ye sari cheeze likhti thi aur wo bahut famous writer hui thi now Uh, let's do the come to the textbook page number forty three. Keep a pencil in your hand and open your textbook. Write new words along with me. So, does a balloon man visit your market? Means whenever you go to the market, you must have seen a balloon man. So let's see what this balloon man brings with him. अब हम ये chapter में ये poem में हम देखेंगे कि balloon man अपने साथ क्या लाता है. The balloon man. He always comes on market days and holds balloons, a lovely bunch. And in the market square he stays, and never seems to think of lunch. Second paragraph: They are red and purple, blue and green. And when it is a sunny day, the carts and people get between. You see, see them shining far away, and some are big and some are small, all tied together with a string. And if there is a wind at all, they tug and tug like anything. Last year, some day perhaps he'll let them go, and we shall see them sailing high. And stand and watch them from below. They would look pretty in the sky. Means your writer has told a small story about the balloon man. So let's start. I am explaining you the chapter. Put a keep pencil in your hand. Write hard words along with me. He always comes on a market days. Means कि जब भी जब भी market लगती है, he always used to come. जैसे कि you must have seen. Somewhere the market used to be on a particular day in some of the places, like uh, uh, some some day on Monday, some day on Tuesday, some day on Friday, uh, in a different different places. So like that, whenever the market days, जब जिस जिस दिन market लगता है, that balloon man used to come and holds balloon a lovely bunch. मतलब कि और फिर वो क्या करता है? Holds balloon. Hold means to carry. वो अपने पास balloon रखता है लवली बंच बहुत सारे वेन मेनी बलून आर डेर सो इट इज अंच ऑफ बलून ओके सो वो बहुत सारे बंच साथ में रखता है सो न्यू वर्ड फॉर यू इज लवली न्यू वर्ड फर्स्ट वन इज एल ओ वी एल वन लवली लवली मीन्स वेरी नाइस Bunch means things tied together. So what he has to is doing is keep and he holds the balloon which are very nice and bunch means uh, he tied it together. And in the 
मार्केट स्क्वेर ही स्टेज मार्केट स्क्वेयर मीन स्टूडेंट्स जो चौराया होता है मीन्स मार्केट की जो कॉर्नर होती है आप सबने देखे होंगे जो सर्कल वर्क वी आर सेइंग दैट स्क्वेयर इज स्टैंडिंग स्टेज मीन्स स्टैंडिंग सो हियर अगेन यू वर्ड इज स्टेज स्टेज मीन्स टू स्टैंड जहां पे वो खड़ा होता है एंड एंड नेवर सिंस टू थिंक ऑफ लंच मीन्स ही वेन ही इज स्टैंडिंग फॉर सेलिंग द बलून ही डिड नॉट थिंक दैट आई हैव इट इज अ नून एंड आई हैव टू गो फॉर हैविंग माई लंच सो थिंक मीन्स टू रिमेम्बर ही डिड नॉट थिंक दैट आई हैव टू गो टू टेक लंच ऑल्सो So he is not thinking that I have to go to have lunch also. So what we have learned into the first paragraph is when the market days are there, balloon man used to come and he is standing at the square. Ek square पे रुकता है जहाँ पे public ज़्यादा आती जाती है, right? And he is standing to sell sell out the all the balloons of him what he is carrying. So in that uh, the way that he is not thinking to have the lunch also. Then second paragraph is they are red and purple, blue and green. And when it is a sunny day, that the cars and people get between. You see them shining far away. Means here they what the charity wants to say the balloons what he is carrying are of red and purple color, blue and green color with the different different colors balloons are there. When it is a sunny day. Where, where he is standing when when it is sunny day also sunny day means it is a bright day right so jab sunny day hota hai even though he used to stand jab bright day hota hai so he is also standing in that day also so he is uh, when it is a sunny day the cats and people get between you see them shining far away means here usually the meaning of cart is we are using for bullock carts right so but here the meaning of cart means the vendors jo aapne dekhe honge lari wale hote hain lorry wale right uh, some are selling something food or some are selling some clothes jo lorry wale hote hain into the market vegetable fruits wale this all so here i try to once to say that cart means vendor जो वेंडर एंड पीपल जो मार्केट में होते हैं गैदरिंग टू द डिफरेंट डिफरेंट प्लेसेस दे कैन सी दैट द बलून मैन इज सेटिंग ओवर एंड द बलून व्हाट ही इज कैरिंग दे आर शाइनिंग दूर से देखेंगे तो दिस डिफरेंट कलर्स आर देयर रेड पर्पल येलो ब्लू ग्रीन जो व्हेन वी सी इट सी देम फ्रॉम द फार ऑफ द प्लेसेस द बलून्स आर शाइनिंग इन अ सनी ब्राइट day so yeah we in the two paragraph what we have learned balloon man comes and uh, he stays in the he comes on the market days and he holds the balloon with himself and uh, after he's not thinking for lunch even and when the other carts and other people uh, they those are in the market they can see the balloon man is standing also and the uh, balloons what he is carrying they are shining also okay so here on other New words are there. Sunny means bright day is the cart in the poem. For meaning of cart is for vendors. Vendors, I have told you, so you can have fruit, uh, the food seller, vegetable seller, clothes seller on the in the market. If you have seen, so they are the vendors, right? The next is shining. Shining means glow. Shining means glow. Now coming to the next paragraph, third paragraph is, and some are big and some are small. Just my balloons are not of all the same of the size. Some are of having a small size. Some are some of are having a huge size. Some are of the different shape. You must have seen the balloons. So, आपने देखे होंगे कि different different colours के balloon different 
shades ke na the in the market it is available uh, cartoon shades balloons are also they are selling so the different shades balloons are there all tied together with a string matlab ki sabhi ek string mein bande hote hain the bhi different different string mein you can see into the picture also so a uh, balloon man has carried a balloon with the string string means a rope a thin rope jisse balloon bande hue hote hain so the eighth number is string string means rope jisse balloon bande hue hote hain okay then and if there is a wind at all means ki agar jab waha hawa chalti hai they tug and tug like anything matlab ki jaise hi hawa aati jati hai to what the balloons that they are pulling to through the, through the air like they are uh, they get pulled towards the air hawa mein wo kheenche jaate hain right idhar se udhar so tug and tug word is for pulling so to pull something hard or quickly जैसे ही हवा आती है वैसे ही वो मूव होते रहते हैं सो योर विंग मीन्स एयर एंड टग एंड टग मीन्स टू पुल क्विकली और हार्डली राइट सो आई एम राइटिंग अ टग वर्ड फॉर यू बिकॉज दिस इज न्यू फॉर यू टग मीन्स टू पुल समथिंग to pull something hard so the balloons who air ke sath idhar se udhar tak hote hain some they perhaps he will he will let them go here they have written h e double l means the meaning of it is he will we have to pronounce it he will okay so some they perhaps he let them go मतलब अब राइटर को यहाँ पे क्या लगता है कि माइट बी पर मींस माइट बी अनदर न्यू वर्ड फॉर यू इज परहेप्स परहेप्स मींस मे बी और माइट राइट मतलब कि शायद What the writer is saying कि समे पर मतलब शायद कि एक दिन वो उसको छोड़ दे एंड वी शेड सी देम सेलिंग हाई और हम उसको वो बलून देखे कि वो सेलिंग हाई मीन्स ऊपर उड़ना जब बलून होते हैं इफ यू इवन कैरियर बलून तो वो हवा में ऐसे ऐसे उड़ते रहते हैं राइट सो जैसे वो हम एयर में मूव होते हैं और उसको हम वेन वी ड्रॉप इट हम उसको छोड़ देते हैं तो वो ऊपर 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 उड़ते जाते हैं so here also the writer is saying see uh, someday perhaps he will let them go maybe agar wo usko kabhi chhod de and we shall see them aur hum unko dekhenge ki wo udte udte upar ja rahe hain selling high means selling high means flying in the sky flying in the sky matlab ki wo upar upar udte jaate hain and stand and watch them from below aur hum usko niche se dekhte hain they are blowing up 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 and up they would look pretty in the sky and what happen they will look very pretty aap sabko pata hai udte hue balloon sapne dekhe honge when we have the the we are giving them to the sky right hum usko sky ke taraf chhod dete hain we are selling it so uh, it looks very pretty it's look very lovely when we are watching that that the balloons so again the new word for you is pretty pretty means lovely it looks very pretty when we sell to them uh, sell them from the below to the sky now uh, here we have done with our story explanation i hope you have understood all the hard words and you are writing also with me let me quickly give you the short story of uh, this so the story was uh, poem was uh, about a balloon man 
वन बलून मैन वॉज देयर वो जब मार्केट डेज में आते हैं वन ई कम यूज टू कम इन टू द मार्केट डेज He holds the balloon, a lovely bunch of balloons. He is carrying with himself, and in the way he used to stand at the market square, uh, where he stands, and he never seems to think of lunch. मतलब कि वो market square, market days में आते हैं ना वो square पे चौराहे पे खड़े रहते हैं नहीं never thinks to have the lunch. और वो बहुत lovely and pretty balloons लेके आते हैं. They are red and purple, blue and green, and when it is sunny day. The cars and people get between you see them shining far away. Means कि ये कहते हैं कि जो balloons हैं वो तो different of colours red, green, purple, yellow. ये जो balloons हैं वो sunny day में means bright day में वो अगर vendors वगैरह देखते हैं तो balloon में ना standing वो easily हम find out easily हम देख सकते हैं because the balloons which are of different colours they are shining in the that sunny day. In the third paragraph, the poet has says, uh, and some are big. The balloons are very small, hote hai, koi big, hote hai, with the different shapes. Jo ek ek patli si string ke saath bande hue hote hai. Or jab wind aati hai, means air aati hai, they are tucked here and there, means they are pulling hardly through towards the wind. Then next is some day perhaps like now in the last paragraph, poet is uh, saying ki uh, she the poet is wishing. That might be the balloon men let the balloons blow, let the balloons sail into the sky, and we can see the balloons from the below that they are shining and they are looking very pretty into the sky. So into the last paragraph, poet is wishing कि वो एक दिन में भी कि वो कि एक दिन बलून को जाने दे to the sky और हम उनको नीचे रह के देखेंगे how looks they pretty. Okay, so hope you have understand the story, a short poem about the balloon man, and uh, you are writing uh, the hard words, new words what I have given, and uh, the new another new spellings are there in the uh, uh, textbook page number forty three. So at the end of the poem, new words are also there. So you have to remember it, students. And into the live session, I will ask you the spelling spellings of it will be there. minutes so you have to remember it thank you and have a nice day